Okay, so I'm going to uh, graphical representation of complex numbers. Now, we're going to do that. And as you have said, a complex number has a real part and an imaginary part. So, that the simple coordinate plane line, you have a horizontal line, real number, number line, no? You have real number line, no? So, that the complex number is a matter. In a simple Cartesian coordinate plane, the complex number in the band will be the imaginary number. So, let's see. In the complex number, we have to form another new plane called complex plane. So that the x axis is real axis, the real number is not true. So that the vertical axis is y axis, the imaginary axis is parallel. So that you have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, you have 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 1, 2, 3, any real number, I mean complex number Z, A plus B, B I is represented by a complex coordinate as a point P, A and B I one. Here again already, let's say your coordinate imaginary monosyllabic one, sometimes it's simply the same as the other one, in the complex plane. So that's it. And the real axis is now the vertical plane. This is not coordinate plane. This is Cartesian. This is not Cartesian coordinate. This is complex coordinate plane. Where imaginary and real plane are. Imaginary and real axis is not complex plane. This complex plane. Who did it? Any point is not it. Every point is uh, associated with an ordered pair A and B, such so that A is a real part and B is a imaginary part. Let's say, this is our subject and the other point is here. Keep me by point and level. A, B, level. I know that A is a real part, A is the element of real number, and B means B, I, and the mat. I have no consonant, I have no mat. So let's see. The second part. The second coordinate is understood that it is an imaginary number one. So, my minimum point in this complex plane has two parts. The real part, the first number is the real part, and the second number is the imaginary part, which is associated with I. So, this point 3, 4, 5, 4 means it's an imaginary number. Z is what 3 plus 4 i number mass. No? So let's see what this is. You have mass will have 3 and 4 i in the one. It's a mass. Good math. I have to say. Already vertical and latching. Vertical latching. Imaginary number is a little bit mass. We don't have to read it. It becomes a little bit to write. Now in the i every. In every point. So let's see. Simply we write 1, 3 and i. The real part one. The real number one. But we are sure that the second coordinate is an imaginary number. We call it BI number in the master channel. So, what is uh, how can I represent this one in Sali? Um, Z3 plus 4 I give you complex numbers. Z plane are equal to the bar. Real part 3 now, x axis 3 here now. Yeah, imaginary part of four I no mass no. It's going to be So let's see. This is represented by this three four or the pair three four, which means three and four four I in the mass no one. Eh, na kaden good. Ka origin is kan tchinya point yano vector no giri complex number di parma. 
ምክንያቱም z is equal to 3 plus 4i የሚለው ይሄ ነው ማለት ይሄ vector number so it is represented by a vector whose end point is 3 4 or a b ስለዚህ um complex number z which is called a plus b i is represented by a complex coordinate p which is equal to a b in the complex number and the vector o b the vector from the origin up to this point a b is the complex number so vector which is o p the vector from the origin up to the point p a b is z which is a plus b i so every complex number is represented by a unit vector i mean a, a vector a position vector you can say it, it starts in the origin mass so every every complex number is represented by a, co a position vector okay what about z is equal to minus three uh, i minus three plus i mallet minimas measure or a one minus three na one no mass okay i is one i mass one here is the other in our complex plane minus three is here and positive one is here each point not mass okay so this is our z mass each one is minus three and i minus three one and minus one come on okay so this is the representation of minus three i or this one is minus three plus i will you know what uh what about z is about five i five i mallet five i mallet zero plus five i mallet so min mass no here mallet z is represented by uh, the ordered pair zero a five so that's five i the mass here talk again the limit of the x coordinate to zero no your y coordinate to five no mass x coordinate to x zero one is equal to five is equal to each point no this one ah uh, this is a vertical a vertical position vector mass so that's any imaginary vector imaginary part, which means that has only imaginary part and it's zero it's three real part is zero you want to know again who do rest on the y-axis works then works on the imaginary axis okay how about it's uh conjugate minus five i what is minus five i minus five i is here so this is a position vector from origin up to 5, I, 0 and 5, I mass. What is the coordinate of this one? This one is 0 and 5, or 0 and 5, I, I mass. The real part is 0 and the imaginary part is 5, mass, which means imaginary 5. Imaginary part is 5 means 5, I, the one is tabakal mass. Okay. So the Z, this is our vector. You see? Uh, z is equal to 0 plus 5i or simply z is equal to 5i in the parallel vector when uh, complex number is a normal. Actually, how about this one? Let's get it up. Let's get it up. Let's get it up. Let's get it up. Z is equal to 2 plus. Minimal. This is a real number. Every real number is a complex number. So I can write in that, in that, in that form. This means 2 plus 0 i mass. So where is the, the, the point? The point is 2 and 0. The imaginary part is 0 and the real part is 2. Where is that? 2, 0. The x is 0, no? The x is 2, let's know. The y is 0, mass. So where is this? This is z is equal to 2 plus 0 i mass. Vector here, mass. It is a, a, a position vector. From the origin up to x is equal to 2 mass. This is the key point manage, key point 2 and 0 not mass. With which its imaginary part is 0. So 
every every complex number of the form z is equal to a, where a is element of real number, rests on the x-axis. X-axis z is equal to the three component equal to zero. Because z is equal to zero. Z is equal to negative three component equal to zero. This is a vector mass. It is on the x-axis mass. Rests or rests on the x-axis. X-axis is a form mass. Any any complex number of the form z is equal to b i u and the polynomial mo, which means zero plus b i minus no, here the mo zero and b minus no, which is on the y-axis mo. Let's say zero five is zero one, zero four is zero one. So that will be this, this vector from origin up to four four i. Zero six from this up to this is a point. So let's see. Maninion, the form is Mr. Maninion, the form is Mr. Maninion. Complex number lies or rests on the vertical axis, on the minor axis. And any uh, complex number which is purely real number rests on the real axis, the x axis. Otherwise, if the real part and the minor part are different from zero, you will get them on the quadrants. Let me say, 3, 4, mallet. 3 is the real part and 4i is the imaginary part. Not so z is equal to 3 plus 4i. How about the conjugate z plus z bar? 3 minus 4i. Where is it? This one is minus 4. x is 3, y is negative 4. x is 3, y is negative 4. It's here. You know, math. So, this one is our. Z bar Z bar is here. He has Z no. P 3, 4, 3 plus 4 i is equal to origin is this mass. 3 minus 4 i is equal This is, they are equal in length. You could not check it out. Again, here now, but I don't know. He has him about the text which is the target. He has him again. Look, they have the same three x, 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 x value. They differ only in their y value or the imaginary part. One is the negative of the other, so it's a reflection of uh, the point P about the x axis map, the real axis map. So, Yanan, them sale, Yihe, Yamano, minus three part. Minus three minus I, yours. This is the conjugate of this one, other. Here is the you gotta make a minus three minus one man, minus three gano, you are a minus one point, you got So this one is Z bar of this one. You have Z corner, you have Z bar. We can conjugate of this one. one mass. So here's the now reflection about the what the x-axis is this one mass. Yeah, proper chart of your So let's see, money point, let me say. Z is equal to my, I mean, two minus five i bended by. Yx y got two no matter no. Yx y got five i no. Zika no. Here no matter no. So let's see the the. This is a complex number. Z which is equal to what? Two minus five i yami by the other here no matter. Now so. Is it going to be the same number? To n minus five. It's understood minus five divided by two minus five. I By default, is it going to be the same number? I got to take it on here. It's our number. So let's see. Here, here, complex number of number. Let's see what we can represent. Any any complex number, be it real part, be it imaginary part, be that contain real and imaginary part. Can be represented by a vector on a complex plane like this. As a complex plane is a plane formed by two vertical axes, where the horizontal, a perpendicular axis, where the horizontal is real axis and the vertical is imaginary axis. Thank you for watching. We have.